everybody welcome back to my channel and today I have another Cuposket haul slash unboxing now I purchased these from eBay and I think they came from I want to say Switzerland but I'm not sure I don't know why I want to say that but it only took two weeks to get here so it was definitely somewhere in Europe um they sent this is actually three of the petite ones it is Ariel Sophia and Aurora now I'm pretty sure they're supposed to come in their own separate boxes but they send them in just one box I think it might be to do with postage costs to keep the postage costs down they do tell you when on the site that they've cut it comes in one box so I think that might be why so they're all squashed into one box but if we take them out here is the packet that they're all in although they are sealed into one bag but they probably have done that themselves I think I think they've put them took them out of their boxes put them in this one bag sealed it and I put it in there I think just to cut down on postage costs I assume so let's open these and have a look now these usually come in three parts the head the body and the stands so let's have a look yep so they're all in three parts so I'll start with so fear one this is my least favorite one if she didn't come in the free pack, I wouldn't have bought her because I don't really know who she is. I think she's like a children's princess, like a TV show. So I'm not really that bothered about this one, but it came in the set. So we have her. So let's open it up. So as you can see, here is the stand and it's got two little notches there. Here is her head. And she does look really, really pretty. The paintwork looks really good on her, actually got a little crown so yeah she looks really really nice and then this is her dress there's a bit of a flaw here on her dress if you can see there that shouldn't be like that that needs to be filed down but the front looks fine let's just put up her head on oh there we go yeah she looks really really cute and then if you can see on her feet she's got two little holes and that is where she will fit onto her stand. Let's try and get her on. Mm, not getting her on that way, so let's try her this way. Nope. There we go, that's better. And there she is on her stand. She's actually really, really cute. I do like her. There we go, that is Sophia. So let's move on to the next one. Next one I'm going to do is Aurora in her blue dress. So here is her stand again it's got two little notches on it and then here is her head oh she does have some flaws on her I do sometimes wonder if these cheap ones are seconds and that's why they're cheap you can see she's got blue paint on her hair so obviously when they were painting the dress and how it's got onto her hair I don't think I'm gonna be able to scratch it off or anything no, it's pretty much on there, but maybe I can paint over this bit so then you can't see it. How much? I actually paid £10 for these three. There you go, but she looks really pretty other than that floor there. She's got a crown. She's got her lovely pretty hair. I do love the detail on the hair. It's really, really nice. I actually wonder if her head is the same as the head for the pink one. I'll have a look in a minute. And then here is her blue dress she's got two holes at the bottom and there's the back so let's just put her head on there we go and put her on her stand you know what I don't think this is the right stand for her because the notches are no way near where they should be for this dress so this is definitely the wrong stand oh no i'm hoping maybe oh, that one doesn't have any notches on <gasps> mm. 
there's a problem. Yeah, there's no way. I'm just going to stand on there. So it looks like I'm going to have to contact the seller about this and see if they can send another stand with the right notches on, which is really annoying. Okay, so I've managed to sort, <laughs> sort of get it to stay on the stand as long as you don't move it. I've just made my own little notches in the bottom. So I'm just comparing it to the um, pink one. So there are the two together. They do look very, very similar. But the stand for this one is very different to that. She actually has a nub on her base and she actually fits into the hole on the base, which is much better, which I think... May have been what's supposed to have happened on this one, which is why I think this is a second and it was actually made wrong, or it's a counterfeit one, which is possible. But there you go. So I might have to glue her onto the stand, I think, because even with the holes that I've made, she still doesn't stand up very well on her stand. No, I'm going to have to glue her, I think. There we go. So as long as you don't move her, she's alright. But well, that's the comparison of the two, the pink and the blue one. So they do look very, very similar. Okay, so finally the last one to do is the aerial one. Let's hope there's nothing wrong with her. So this is the main reason I bought this set because I really wanted this one. I know this one just sits on the stand. She doesn't um, have any um, little holes, so hopefully there shouldn't be anything wrong with this one. So you see her stand has nothing on because she just sits on it. Here is her dress. So in there you can see she's little shoes, little knickers. And there is the front. There is a little floor here. Maybe just get that off. There you go. A little extra bit of plastic. I don't think you actually saw that. There's a little bit of extra plastic there, but it's just come off. Paintwork isn't great. I think the little bit extra plastic it was a bubble so now you can see there's like a little focus there look like a little hole there the paintwork there isn't great but when she's on the shelf you won't notice so let's put it together let's have a look at her head so here is her head and she's absolutely gorgeous look how pretty she is you can see her little earring you can see her gorgeous hair so there's nothing wrong with her face, the paintwork on her face is perfect. So let's put her head on. Oh. There she is, how cute is she? It's a shame about that little bit, but once she's on the, on the shelf you won't notice. So she just stands on her stand, just like that. So I'm just going to put them all together and you can see them all stood up together. So here are the three all together. I think they look really, really cute. I will be contacting the seller to see if they can send me the correct stand for Aurora because she does keep falling over on that wrong stand. But yeah, otherwise I'm really, really happy with them. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed this little video. If you have, please give it a like. Don't forget to subscribe and I hope to see you again soon. Bye.